But it kind of gives the look I was going for, I guess. Maybe. More well, makeup. Hello, hello, welcome back to the channel. How are you guys doing today? I hope you're having an amazing day today. I'm excited because um, today, literally in about, actually by the time this video is out, I would have landed. I will be in LA. My LA virginity is gonna be taken by Coachella. I'm excited. So I thought I'd show you guys some of the things that I got um, for Coachella and some other stuff. It's very quick. It's only a few days in each place. So I don't have a lot of stuff. Let's start getting into the haul. Mm, 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 I'm excited. Hello, hello, hello. What is this? So this is the first thing that I'm gonna try on. These are some trousers. They're wide leg flow trousers from Misguided and um, yeah, they're looking a bit see-through. They're looking a bit see-through. I did get this to like, for a festival or to go on a beach. I don't know which one I'm gonna use it for just yet, but um, I'm thinking it's more like a beach vibe because I'm gonna have to wear bikini bottoms with this. But I'm gonna try it anyway. Okay, so, um. They're on. I'm not sure how I feel about it. It just reminds me of one of those skirts that have the splits on the sides. Um, yeah, even though it's supposed to be trousers, it doesn't look like how I envisaged it would look, but that's okay. I don't think I'd wear this to Coachella. I just feel like it's too much fabric to be dragging around. I want something short and flowy and it's very, very see-through. I'm wearing it with a thong bikini that I bought. <laughs> for Jamaica because I thought you know I'm gonna be I'm gonna be bold try something new and my friend that I'm going with she is just thongs galore that's all she wears on the beach so I was like okay let me be let me be brave try something new on the beach in Jamaica it's gonna be a whole new world a new I don't know the um Aladdin song but that's that's what's gonna happen on the beach you know what sometimes you have to try new things let your friends encourage you let me try on the top with this this is like a lacy, a lacy blazer, but they're different colors, so I don't think it's gonna work, and it's gonna be, it's not gonna look how I expect. Um, hmm, I don't know. It's not again not what I expected, and I'm gonna say that a lot. But um, I wish they made the lace bottoms. I can't actually remember if they make the lace bottoms or not, or maybe they just didn't have it in my size to go with this. You have to wear a white bra with this. It, in my opinion, or just no bra at all if your girls can like cover it just some pasties. But my girls are big and um, as you can see, the, the, the material doesn't even want to stretch over there. It doesn't even want to... It needs a little bit of boob tape, a little bit of boob tape right here. But for me, like this is kind of sexy but classy, but hood, but bougie, but I don't know, thotty, but ev everything, like everything in one. I kind of, I kind of dig it. I kind of like it. I would wear this to a beach party, um, an all white party. We'll see, we'll see. Um, I don't, I'm not sure about the back. It looks a bit, it looks a bit matronly from the back. You know, you sort of look all covered up and kind of prude, but then you turn around and it's like pow, 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 pow. boobs, thighs, like yeah, combo, KFC. <laughs> You've got more breasts and thighs than KFC, people. Jamaica Carnival is gonna be a movie, so I'm sure there's an all white party somewhere that I'm gonna rock this too because <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm channeling my auntie right now. Hi, Auntie Tamara, I see you. <laughs> this one is a jeans dress. Well, it's meant to look like jeans, but the material doesn't feel like jeans. Um, it's really cute, very simple. I had a dress like this when I went to St. Lucia last year. I went to St. Lucia in January as well, but year before. The time before that, I had a white version of this dress. Um, it was so pretty that I decided to get, get one in a different color, because when it's nice, you get it in a different color. You get all the colors, babe. When it fits you well and it looks good, get all the colors. <laughs> the boobs look amazing in this dress though. The only thing that I don't like about it is that the straps, they're quite fiddly. Um, you need somebody to help you like, mm. that's the only thing I just don't like about them. Obviously you do the straps beforehand, but they still take ages to like pull them. And then when you're not sure if you get it right, then you have to go back and try and do it again. Just make straps that are easy. You can just pull them, tug, and then you're done. Like, who wants to be sitting there doing straps all day? Anyway, um, so the way that this works is, obviously, 
it's like a skirt and a top together as one in the back and then you have the buttons going down you can you know put as many buttons as you like to make it as prudish or as sexy as you want and um then you've got oh see see it just released the girls like pfft. and then you, when you tighten it the girls come back to life so that's that's pretty much but make sure you tie it tight because if anybody pulls on those strings that's it that's it babe your girls are gonna be <laughs> doing helicopters um i think i'm just gonna use this to walk around la this isn't for coachella or anything just to you know look pretty walking around la it's my first time going to la so i'm a bit i'm a bit excited i'm really nervous as well because coachella i've never been to coachella before and um my friend wants to camp like tents and all of that stuff it's rhinestones for the boobs like in the middle of the boobies for whatever outfit i'm going to choose but i might i might use this for carnival like the jamaica carnival i'm excited i might use this for the carnival outfit again my jamaica carnival outfit is going to be a thong back excuse me excuse me me raven in thongs what's going on but you know what? Grown women have to try grown women vibes. Do you know what I mean? Chanelli, I blame you for this. I blame you for all the thong, thong-esque shit that's about to happen. It's your fault. Na -na 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 -na. Woo! Na -na -na. No, I'm joking. Okay. Um, hmm. 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 This is cute. This though, I feel I need. I most definitely 100% I need Spanx um, just to hide the just to hide the chub chub I need some Spanx uh, and we need some boob tape but this is a nice dress so the one time the one time that I need friggin adjustable straps is the one time that Miss Guided decided no this dress doesn't need adjustable straps we're not gonna put it in there so if I bend over I feel like my boobs will just the one time I actually need the straps. Like, why misguided? Why? 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 I think I might have to do some adjustments and like put this up and in so that, you know, the girl stand up and in. Let me give you guys a little trick. If your nipples jet out, if your nipples like to say, hey, if your nipples are friendly, pop your nipples into the seams of um, your outfit. That way they are hidden in the seams and they won't just be saying hey to every Tom, Dick and Harry that goes past. Okay, this could be for dinner somewhere in LA or New York or Jamaica, anywhere because I'll be everywhere. <laughs> so, yeah, this is nice. Oh, and um, it has like double zip, so there's a zip at the top here and there's a zip at the bottom, so you can, like, um, if it works, yeah, you can open it up at the bottom if you want like more space. Or, but that's just hoochie, we don't need to be hoochie today. Let's keep it. We already have two hoochie outfits, so yeah. I might buy some more things when I get to LA, I'm not sure. Oh, I am feeling this one. Can someone say tropical? I'm feeling like a tropical bird of paradise. Yes, yo, I'm out here, I'm out. <laughs> Can I invoke my Cardi B a little bit? <laughs> To be fair, my auntie was doing that before Cardi B was born, but you know, whatever. I, I feel like the flamingo dance, I should be like, cha cha Um, yeah, but I feel like my boobs will pop out if I do that a bit too much, so. Because it doesn't exactly fit. This is a size 12. The top fits fine. The top is okay. My boobs are a bit big in them, a bit busty. Um, but the top fits, like I can move around, blah, blah, blah. but the bottom, <sighs> The bottom, the bit, this doesn't fit right. It doesn't zip. Oh, like it's just, <laughs> why? And if I got in a 14 in it, it would be too big on the waist. It would fall a bit, because I've had these before and most times they don't fit. Um, they don't fit too. St Sorry about that. Can't control the traffic. Um, yeah, most times they don't fit too well. 
just here. I mean, I know, I put on weight, okay, yeah, I've gone up a dress size. It used to be a size 10 to 12, now I'm a 12 to 14. That's fine, um, but I'm not really a 14 because 14 trousers are too big in the waist still. And um, if I were to zip this, try and zip it, then it will be going all up in my... So um, I already have a split. I don't need another split down there with the trousers going all up in it. So I think I'll just leave it, <laughs> leave it like this. And uh, I wouldn't wear a bra. I don't think I need a bra with this. I just think I need some tape, but I am wearing a bra underneath, but it's making them really like, and I don't want that. So let's adjust. We're all girls here, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Let's adjust that. Pull this down in the back and this, yeah, that looks okay. This really reminds me of that red dress that I wore to Morocco. I haven't done the Morocco vlog yet, so you haven't seen it. I'm so, so sorry. I swear to God, my Instagram is two or three months ahead of my YouTube. I am, I'm really, really, really sorry. Um, but this is the red dress that I'm talking about. Everybody went crazy for it. Loads of people bought it and uh, I think it's sold out now. But it did. It, it is really, really pretty, really pretty. And this one's gonna be exactly the same. I can't wait. I can't wait to rock, 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 rock it up. Well, I'm not. It's Jamaica Carnival, but I'm not gonna be hearing that. I'm gonna be hearing soca, so it's gonna be. If the man can't do the work, girl, come over, let me backfill there. Backfill back, back, over there. Backfill back, down there. Wait, so I can talk from this. <laughs> Damn it. Honestly, I feel like everything I've gotten so far is more for Jamaica than it is for Coachella. Like, I feel like I haven't gotten any outfits for Coachella. I mean, I know Coachella's only three days. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So I only need three outfits. But I don't feel like I have anything. Maybe I could wear this, but this to me just feels a bit blah. This to me feels like a little lunch outfit in Jamaica, like just doing nothing, you know? Not for Coachella. I have no idea what I'm going to wear to Coachella, still. But I mean, I guess maybe with some boots and a hat, cowboy hat. I feel like everybody will be wearing cowboy boots and cowboy hats specifically Gucci cowboy hats I'm gonna take my horse to the old town road I'm gonna ride till I can't no more I'm gonna take my horse to the my boobs are popping out in this see I can't wear this to Coachella I can't dance in it I got I didn't get any jeans so I'm gonna try on this top with these but I'm not gonna wear them with these in real life I'm just trying it on okay disclaimer I'll be right back Okay, I got one simple California t-shirt, just one. Just one California t-shirt because when in Rome, you know, just got a picture of a car and it says Sunset Boulevard, which I'm guessing I'm gonna have to visit. Probably wearing this shirt to be really cliche, I don't know. But yeah, I feel like I needed just, just one just chilled, absolutely relaxed t-shirt vibe. And this is it. You know when you order things and you can't remember what it is that you ordered? I don't know what this is. A sequin bodysuit. I bought a bodysuit. Okay. I bought a sequin bodysuit. What was my intention? I, I'm assuming I bought this for Coachella. Um, it is, it is what I was thinking of in terms of tassels and cowboy s, but it's not what I was expecting. Like, it doesn't look how I imagined in my head. Probably because I, I, I'm not wearing shorts, but if I were wearing shorts with this right now, it would just look like it's a sequin top and it has no flair, it has no pizzazz. It's, it's not see-through and I thought it was, but it has this lining on the inside that makes it just bland so I mean I guess if I were to cut off the lining in the inside it would look a lot better but it's not really what I wanted what I was expecting oh my god I've said that a lot in this haul and it's it's really hot it's like the material was making making it stick to my skin I don't like that 
Oh, that's a shame. Maybe I can do something with it though. I'm not sure, but I definitely got this for the valley and it doesn't it doesn't really do anything. I guess I'll need the cowboy hat and the, the, the yeah. I really want to do a cowboy look because I'm gonna be in the desert. Ugh. Well, I mean, I, I don't really know if it's a if it's desert. In the valley. Fuck's sake. Okay. I don't have any shorts as yet, so I can't try on shorts for you guys, but it kind of gives the look I was going for, I guess. When you think about the boots and then I get the shorts, and I guess it will look kind of how I imagined it to look. Ugh. Not pleased. I'm not happy. Whatever. It, it will it will come together. When I put it all together, you guys will see in the vlogs and on Instagram and stuff. It, it will look like it'll look like I'm, I'm good at this. I'm good at this. It'll be fine. Again, I got another lounge around dress. Um, I don't like this one because the band, well, where it zips up, is right under the boob. So when a dress is right under your boob like that, where it has a band, it rounds out your stomach and makes it look big. So it looks like a maternity dress. It doesn't really have any shape and you can't really wear a bra with this. If I take off the bra, the dress collapses and it loses its shape and it doesn't hold your boobs. That's not cute, this isn't cute. Why? And it also reaches all the way to the floor. It does have a split. Um, I got this because I thought it would be cute to wear to dinner or just, you know, have a nice little maxi dress running around. But it doesn't quite... I mean, I suppose I could pull it down, but... Ugh, it's not exactly what I wanted. And it makes my boobs look weird. There we go. Mm, I don't know. It's not bad, but it's not great. I'm not a fan. Let me try this with a hat. That's a hell no. <laughs> okay, so I've got the bikini bottom in my hand. The one thing that I will say is that I'm disappointed in the craftsmanship and the tailoring of this. First of all, the string is coming apart. Like, what is, why? What's the meaning of this? I get it, it's cheap and fast fashion. Like, it's like fast food, but misguided you're, you're used to doing at least okay quality stuff right that's why I like misguided it's affordable the whole point of fast fashion is that people don't want to be seen wearing the same thing too many times so they wear it maybe once or twice and then eventually it falls apart and they're gonna throw it away or they're gonna give it to someone or you know whatever basically it's not gonna be around forever that's the whole point right um, but just because it's not gonna be around forever doesn't mean it has to look like you put it together in two seconds also also why is the bikini bottom movable like that's not a good idea now you have bikini tops and you can move the string along so you can adjust the triangle parts that go over your boobs they've done that with the bikini bottom who said that that was a good idea first of all all that's going to happen is that when you put this on like most women what I have can't be covered by this, okay? What, what is, what? Do you see me? How do you think this? So you have to be like watching yourself being precarious on the beach, trying not to make this slide in between your, your vag lips. Like that's the only, that's what I, that's, that's what it is. This is gonna slide between your Gucci! No! Okay, so this is the top and this is the bottom and it will do exactly what I said if I am not careful. It will just sign up, yeah. So I'm not even gonna, this isn't gonna make it into the suitcase, but I just thought I would show you guys because I bought it. I like the top. I think the top is cute. Um, I'm not sure about the bottom. So that's it you guys, I guess we're going to finish on a, a, a high slash medium note. I like the top, don't like the bottom. I guess not everything I got was coachella -y. I think I only got like two things that are acceptable for Coachella. But it doesn't matter. The point of the matter is that I got things that I like that will be good for holiday. Um, I'm going to three different places so I need a wide range of things and I'll buy things while I'm there like cowboy boots hats I'm not gonna buy that in London where we have like no need for cowboy stuff so the stuff we're probably gonna get is probably gonna go shit anyway so I'm not gonna go do that when I can just get it when I'm there that makes more sense to me right so 
Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know what was your favorite and what you would buy and if you're going to be at Coachella. Bye, guys.